many parts of the United States and the world are still covered in snow. It is about to pour here in San Diego where I live. But with a new season, I feel like it is always such a good opportunity to just bring in some fresh life to your house. And so I came up with five simple things that you can do that are easy and on a budget to make your home and your space feel refreshed for the new season upon us. So let me show you what the five things are. First things first, I love bringing the outdoors in and I'm loving doing so with flowering branches. I pick these branches up at my local wholesale mart, but I've even seen them at grocery stores like places like Trader Joe's. And for this huge bundle of, for $10, I got all these branches. What you're gonna wanna do is trim them based on the height of your um, container that you will be sticking them in. So I'm using something rather tall, but they already are tall, so I'm giving mine a good trim. And then you're gonna wanna take a mallet or a hammer and hammer out the edges really good. That way it'll be able to absorb water. Now you'll stick them in your jar and they will look a little brown, but just give it a day or two and new life will spring from your branches. They're just something that's so fun and refreshing about having actual blooming branches inside your house. It just, I do it every single year around this time and it just, brings new life, it makes me energized, and I just love it. It's a very simple way to usher in spring. The second way of bringing life inside is to just adorn your house with fresh greenery. Head down to Home Depot, Lowe's, your, your local nursery, and just pick up some inexpensive plants, put them in pots. I will share with you, link to you, the video that I made, this little arrangement that's here on my dining room table. But just little mini pots and fresh greenery go a long way. The third way I love, that is the easiest and most simple thing to do, is just to clear off your spaces. Clear off surfaces, start fresh. Do clear off your mantle, clear off counters. Put away things and all your, your clutter and your tchotchkes that have collected over time, put them away. Allow everything to just breathe for a little bit and then after a day or two, you can go back and say, okay, I actually am missing this picture frame here. Or I really am missing this um, large seashell. Um, but if you can just kind of clear everything out at the beginning of each season, I learned this from McQuillan Smith who does Cozy Minimalist Home. Sometimes we just need a fresh space clear our brains and then after a couple days you can bring things back in and they feel um, like new life again or you just kind of like to rearrange things and that's okay too. Another thing that I feel like really makes my house feel like spring is just fresh flowers. Just get a couple fresh flowers, put them in a little mini bud vase and stick it on a little end table, side table or go stick one by your bedside. It is an easy, simple way to just uh, make a space feel really beautiful and special. And my last tip is to update linens, add pillows, take away pillows. I noticed that my bedding felt very wintry and fall-like with the gingham and just the cozy patterns that I had. And so I took away a throw pillow and I changed the shams out on my bed for just some shams that I had previously had that are a little bit lighter, brighter, more cheery. And I redid my bed and I added a bright pillow to it and that just was something that I already had on hand but that um, was a nice fresh update. Um, and then I also went around my house and I added pillows to places that seemed a little bit bare that needed a little bit more color or life. Um, so just kind of mixing things around your house that you already had or you had tucked away for a season and bringing it back out. Tucking away the old, the fall, the wintry items is another very easy thing that you can do. That's it. I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you go around and I hope this inspires you to springify your space a little bit. We'll be back soon with a lot more fun videos in the coming week ahead. All right. Bye guys.